In 2013, Icarus Interstellar, the premier name in deep space science, research, and advocacy, staged Starship Congress, the first ever summit of interstellar and deep space science organizations and science professionals. At Starship Congress 2013, we didn't know what to expect. It was the first time we had pulled together organizations, individuals, and advocates in deep space exploration to decide on research and directions that would lead humankind to interstellar accomplishment. What we found exceeded our expectations. It was monumental. The conference had enjoyed student participation from a number of universities. We found that the students were interacting with professionals, exchanging ideas, and discussing various aspects of spacecraft design, advances that would be necessary in order to build the starship. Interstellar space exploration is inherently so incredibly cool, but the only problem is it's also incredibly difficult. This is why we need to get something like Starship Congress together. Starship Congress 2013 was one of the most influential experiences I've ever had with science. Um, I was surrounded by scientists and other space enthusiasts and being a high schooler at the time, one of the youngest people there, it really solidified ideas that I had about space and what I want to do in the future. To build a starship, we will need to approach problem solving with creativity and spontaneity. We will need to forget and reinvent the ways that we do research. We will need to look at the physical and technological boundaries and try to figure out ways to transcend them. We will need to work together to literally hack space. It was with this in mind that we named Starship Congress 2, Starship Congress 2015, Interstellar Hackathon. A hackathon is an intentional community of like-minded individuals temporarily problem-solving together. The success of Starship Congress 2015 was the attending students interacting with the presenting scientists and coming up with spontaneously with solutions to the challenges of interstellar space exploration. For that reason, we decided to host Starship Congress 2015 at a university setting, which is why we chose Drexel University. Drexel University is in Philadelphia, which is close to New York City, and it's a major airline hub, and it's also home to the very first university chapter of Icarus Interstellar. And one other thing has happened since 2013 and now. A major science fiction film, heavy on the science, went on to become an international blockbuster smash. Christopher Nolan's Interstellar. Before Interstellar, the challenges of interstellar space exploration was outside the grasp of most people worldwide. But Interstellar changed all that. Almost overnight, fans of the idea suddenly had a working knowledge of interstellar space exploration and what it means and, and what it takes. There has, since 2013, there has been a revolution of understanding and popularity of interstellar space exploration. For that reason, in ways that we would not have been able to anticipate in 2013, we are looking forward to students and scientists working together and hacking out solutions to interstellar space science challenges at the 2015 edition of Starship Congress. With that in mind, for Starship Congress 2015, we are doubling down on everything that made the first Starship Congress the grand slam it was. We are bringing new speakers with fresh presentations, along with the return of favorite speakers debuting new or further developed work. Workshops, breakaway sessions, and of course hacking sessions, where future science professionals will work alongside highly accredited professionals to look at the challenges we face for interstellar exploration with new eyes. By funding the Kickstarter for Starship Congress 2015, we will be building on the success of the first Starship Congress and opening doors for an entire next generation of science and space science professionals to begin work on bringing about the single greatest exploration mission in the history of humankind. The journey to visit another star, another solar system, another Earth, and possibly even another intelligent species. Please support Starship Congress and join us in developing the tools, the science, and the team that will one day get us there. Thank you.